Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing great as always. So today is kind of a one-off that I was not planning on doing at all. I saw one of the YouTubers that I watch, they posted a series of playing through Portal 2 story quest. And I realized myself that I never actually played through it myself. I played Portal 1 many times. And I played Portal 2 uh, co-op campaign, but I never actually touched the single player version. So sadly and embarrassingly, I know nothing about it. So here is where this comes in. This isn't going to be its own series, which means it's not going to get a dedicated day for it. But I still want to play through it and I want to share my experience with you guys. So this is probably going to be tacked on on top of whatever particular episode I'm posting on some day as just an addition. I hope you guys enjoy watching me go through Portal 2 for the first time because I have a feeling that I will enjoy it very much myself. Let's get into it. Good morning. You have been in suspension for 50 days. In compliance with state and federal regulations, all testing candidates in the Aperture Science Extended Relaxation Center must be revived periodically for a mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look up at the ceiling. Good. You will hear a buzzer. When you hear the buzzer, look down at the floor. Wait, there's Good. something. This completes the gymnastic portion of your mandatory physical and mental wellness exercise. It didn't take much. There is a framed painting on the wall. Please go stand in front of it. This is art. You will hear a buzzer. When is you it hear now? the buzzer, stare at the art. Uh. You should now feel mentally reinvigorated. <laughs> if you suspect staring at art has not provided the required intellectual sustenance, Reflect briefly on this classical music. Reflecting. Good. Now, please return to your bed. Really? Good morning. You have been in suspension for... Nine, 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 nine. Hello? Anyone in there? Hello? Are you going to open the door? At any time? Oh, that took a while. Are you going to open this door? Because it's, fa it's fairly urgent. Oh, just open the door! Stop yelling at me, Jesus. Why not open the door? Oh, that poor plant. Could be Spanish. Could be Spanish. Could be Spanish. Hola, amigo. <laughs> la puerta. Donde right, esta... fine. No. Fine. Ah! Ah! Oh god, you look um good. Looking good actually. Are you okay? How are you don't answer that. I'm absolutely sure you're fine. There's plenty of time for you to recover. All Just right. take it. Slow. Please prepare for emergency evacuation. Stay calm, stay stay calm, prepare. It's all the same, prepare. It's all fine. Alright. Don't move. I'm gonna get us out of here. Oh, you might wanna hang on to something. Word of advice. Up to oh you. no. I'm gonna sit here. No, I can't sit here. God damn it. You alright down there? Can you hear me? Uh? Hello? Most test subjects do experience some uh, cognitive deterioration after a few months in suspension. Now you've been under for quite a lot longer and it's not out of the question that you might have a very minor case of serious brain damage. <laughs> but don't be alarmed, all right? Uh, although if you do, if you do feel alarm, try to hold on to that feeling because that is the proper reaction to being told that you've got brain damage. Do you understand what I'm saying at all? Does any of this make I'm, any sense? I'm nodding. Just tell me. Just say yes. Okay. What you're doing there is jumping. <laughs> uh, you just you just jumped. But never mind. Say apple. Apple. Jumple. Okay. You know what? That's close enough. Just hold tight. All reactor core safeguards are now non-functional. Please prepare for reactor core meltdown. Okay, look, I wasn't going to mention this to you, but I'm in pretty hot water here. How are you doing down there? You still holding on? 
the reserve power ran out, so of course the whole relaxation centre stops waking up the bloody test subjects. Hold on, this is a bit tricky. And of course, nobody tells me anything. No, why should you tell me anything? Why should I be kept informed? You know, about the life functions of the 10,000 bloody test subjects I'm supposed to be in charge of. There's more rooms like Why? mine. It's close. Can you see? Am I going to make it through? I've got enough space. Uh, just, just got to get through here. Okay, I just got to concentrate. Is he doing that? And whose fault do you think it's going to be when the management comes down here and finds 10,000 flipping vegetables? Alright, see, so now I hit that one. I hit that one. Okay, listen, we should get our story straight, all right? If anyone asks, and no one's going to ask, don't worry, but if anyone asks, tell them as far as you know, the last time you checked, everyone looked pretty much alive, all right? Not dead. Not okay, dead. almost there. Not dead at all. On the other side of that wall is one of the old testing tracks. There's a piece of equipment in there that we're going to need to get out of here. I, I think this is a docking station. Get ready. What do I do? Oh no. Good news! That is not a docking station. So there's one mystery solved. Uh, it says uh, below. I'm going to attempt a manual override on this wall. Could get a bit technical. Hold on. Almost there! Remember, Sounds... you're looking for a gun that makes holes. Not bullet holes. But don't worry, you'll figure it out. Seriously, do hold on this time. Sounds a little too close to percussive maintenance method. There we go. Now I'll be honest, you are probably in no fit state to run this particular type of cognitive gauntlet. But um, <laughs> at least you're a good jumper. Thank so you. You've got that, you've got the jumping on your side. Um, just do your best and I'll meet you up ahead. All right then. All right, off you go. Okay. Go on, just march on through that hole. To... Okay. Good luck! Hello. Hey, again, this looks familiar. Amateur Science Enrichment Center. We are currently experiencing technical difficulties due to circumstances of potentially apocalyptic significance oh. beyond our control. <laughs> However, thanks to emergency testing protocols, testing can continue. These pre-recorded oh, messages will provide instructional and motivational support so that science can still be done even in the event of environmental, social, economic, or structural collapse. No Gladys for me this time. And emergency testing will begin in three, two, one. Oh, hello. Hey, we look the same. This testing environment looks a lot different though. Hello? Cube and button-based testing remains an important tool for science, even in a dire emergency. Oops. If cube and button-based testing caused this emergency, don't worry. The odds of this happening twice are very slim. Oh, cube. I missed you so. Please note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material emancipation grill will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through. So far... The narrative is the same. The environment is way, way different. If you feel liquid running down your neck, relax, lie on your back, and apply immediate pressure to your temples. You are simply experiencing a rare reaction in which the material emancipation grill may have emancipated the ear tubes inside your head. Oh, great. Just what I want to hear about my ear tubes. Cube, place on button. Well, this is fun. Where's my paired portal? Portal. Ah, I see. 
I see. Okay, so the first one I want here. Now let's do this. Perfect. And the last one. Good. Woohoo! Because of the technical difficulties we are currently experiencing, your test environment is unsupervised. Before re entering a relaxation vault at the conclusion of testing, please take a moment to write down the results of your test. An Aperture Science Reintegration Associate will revive you for an interview when society has been rebuilt. Do you guys see all of those things piling up on top of my elevator here? If the Earth is currently governed by a manner of animal king, sentient cloud, or other governing body that either refuses to or is incapable of listening to us, then what? Okay, no more pile, so that's good. Oh, hi. Uh. No instructions, all right. Hey, hey! You made it! Hey! There should be a, a portal device on that podium over there. I can't see it, though. Maybe it fell off. Oh, Don't it definitely did. Oh! Hello? Can I Can swim? the portal gun? Also, are you alive? <laughs> hey, Can Arrow. Um, do you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna work on the assumption that you're still alive. And hey, it's here! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Then I'll come back. And Is that Gladys? Go supposedly? See you. see you in an hour, hopefully. If you're not dead. Portal gun. Someone ascended. Is that me? It's kind of a good portrait. Oh yeah, that's me with Gladys. Blue portal. Now, let's go here. Okay, so it's 150. Oh, I appreciate this. This is nice. It shows you which ones are on. Some emergency testing may require prolonged interaction with lethal military androids. Rest oh. assured that all lethal military androids have been taught to read and provided with one copy of the laws of robots to share. To share? Hey, there we are. Good. If you feel that a lethal military android has not respected oh. your rights as detailed in the laws of robotics, please note it on your self-reporting form. A future Aperture Science Entitlement Associate will initiate the appropriate grievance filing paperwork. Thank you for, uh, sucking all of those out, I guess. This next test is very dangerous. To help you remain tranquil in the face of almost certain death, smooth jazz will be deployed. In three, <laughs> two, one. Oh, perfect. I feel calmer already. Oh, not so calm anymore. All right, cube and button. There we go. All right, we got button, button one.
in button two. Great work. Because this message is pre-recorded, any observations related to your performance are speculation on our part. Please disregard any undeserved compliments. Is that right? Oh. Oh shit, okay, never mind. <laughs> We're good. Oh no. It still worked. Good. Aha! Let's check out what's up here. Unreason. Kitty! I like the cube being ever-present. Can't go there. Sorry, my dog's barking. Woohoo! So we need to get the second part of the portal gun still. Just like in the first uh, iteration. If the Enrichment Center is currently being bombarded with fireballs, meteorites, or other objects from space, please avoid unsheltered testing areas wherever a lack of shelter from space debris does not appear to be a deliberate part of the test. Oh, thank you. Great advice. Water. That's not good. Wait. I need to get in there first. Woo! <laughs> Okay, what do we have here? Cube. Not so much. There's more buttons. Okay, so... Nothing here. That could help me. Uh, ooh, hey, the floor is interactable, I think. There we go. <laughs> Glitchy. Oh, good. So I need another cube. Uh, never mind. I need something else. Is that another cube? Oh, uh, okay. Great. What does this one do? Oh, got it. Perfect. Well Ooh. done. The enrichment center reminds you that although circumstances may appear bleak, you are not alone. <laughs> All Aperture Science personality constructs will remain functional in apocalyptic, low-power environments of as few as 1.1 volts. Somehow, I don't believe you. Wonder why. Hmm. This next test applies the principles of momentum to movement through portals. If the laws of physics no longer apply in the future, God help you. Haha. Ha. Okay. Cubes. Buttons. Oh, and momentum. Nice. Okay, floor is not interactable again. Let's see. So, what do I do, then? 
I think this is it. There we go. Where did the cube go? Oh, whoops. Hopefully... Whew. There's still no... No fall damage. Good. Good placement. Perfect. If you are a non-employee who has discovered this facility amid the ruins of civilization, welcome. And remember, testing is the future. And the future testing starts with you. Is the future. Alright, so we don't really know what's going on here yet. I just like doing that, don't ask. It's from the first portal. Okay, so what do I need to do? There's a button down that way, and, uh... Aha. Uh -huh. No? So here? Whee! <laughs> I made it far. Good. Okay, so now I need to make it to the other side. Uh, let's try there. See how that goes. Mm. Okay, not so much, but we can probably manage. There. Ooh, right in the wall. So this is where I need to go. As high as I can. Good Perfect. work getting this far, future starter. That said, if you are simple-minded, old, or irradiated in such a way that the future should not start with you, please return to your primitive tribe and send back someone better qualified for testing. I'm brain damaged, apparently. Uh, according to a piece of GLaDOS. To ensure that sufficient power remains for core testing protocols, all safety devices have been disabled. The Enrichment Center respects your right to have questions or concerns about this policy. Oh. Alright, so we still don't really know what happened. Um... Hey! Oh, hello? hi, hello. I'm up here! Where? There you are. Oh, brilliant! You did find a portal gun! Oh, the, do you know what? It just goes to show, people with brain damage are the real heroes in the end, aren't they, at the end of the day? Brave. Pop a portal on that wall behind me there, and I'll meet you on the other side of the room. Woo! Okay, listen, let me lay something on you here. It's pretty heavy. They told me never, never, ever to disengage myself from my management rail or I would die. Ooh. But we're out of options here. So get ready to catch me, all right? Oh, on the shit. off chance that I'm not dead the moment I pop off this thing. On three. Ready? Yes. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. That's high. It's it's too high, isn't oh, it? Oh, come really? on, that, you pussy. All right, going on three just gives you too much time to think about it. Let's uh, go on one this time. Right. Okay, ready? One. Catch me, catch me. Ow. Ow. I tried. I am not dead. I'm not dead. No, you're not. <laughs> Plug me into that stick on the wall over there, yeah? And I'll show you something. You'll be impressed by this. Oh, hello. Um, yeah, I can't do it if you're watching. Seriously, I'm not, I'm not joking. Could you just turn around for a second? Uh, you... Ping and anxiety? All right, you can turn around now. Bam! Secret panel. Right open. While well, your back was turned, pick me up and off we go. All right. Look at this! No rail to tell us where to go. Oh, this is brilliant. We can go wherever we want. Just 
Hold on, though. Where are we going? Seriously. Hang on, let me just <laughs> get my bearings. Um, where are we going? That's just true. Just follow the rail, actually. Oh, no. Oh, oh no. Yes. No, 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 we're not stopping. Don't make eye contact. Whatever you do. No, thanks. We're good. Appreciate it. Keep moving. Keep moving. Hello. Hello. Is it me you're looking for? I am having so much fun. This is very reminiscent of Portal 1. Probably ought to bring you up to speed on something right now. In order to escape, we're going to have to go through her chamber. And she will probably kill us if, if she's um, awake. Lotus. If you want to just call it quits, we could just sit here forever. That's an option. Option A, sit here, do nothing. Option B, go through there. And if she's alive, she'll almost certainly kill us. We'll see. Okay, I'm gonna lay my cards on the table. I don't want to do it. I don't want to go in there. Don't, don't go in there. Don't, she, she's off. She's off. Don't panic over. She's off. All fine. On we go. Yeah, that is hers. Look at that. There she is. What a nasty piece of work she was. Honestly, like a proper maniac. Do you know who ended up? Uh, do you know who ended up taking her down in the end? You're yeah. not gonna believe this. A human. I know. I know. I wouldn't have believed it either. Apparently, this human escaped, and uh, nobody's seen him since. Then there was a sort of long chunk of time where. Um, Absolutely nothing happened. And then there's us escaping now, so um, that's pretty much the whole story. You're up to speed. Don't touch me. Where do we go now? That's the incinerator. Oh, hello. Okay, down these stairs. Jump! This, actually, look at it. That is quite a, that's quite a distance, isn't it? Yeah, a little okay, bit. Okay, you know what? Uh, go ahead and jump. You've got you've got braces on your legs. So ah! Oh, still held, still being held. You that's a great job. You've applied uh, the grit. We're all fine. That's tremendous. Tremendous. That's the word. Ah! I just sorry. I just looked down. I do not recommend it. Ah! I've <gasps> done it again. Oh shit! Um, okay. This is the main breaker room. Let's go in. Now what do we do? Look for a switch that says escape pod. All right, don't touch anything else. Not interested in anything else. Don't touch anything else. Don't, don't even look at anything else. Just, well, obviously you've got to look at everything else to, to find the escape pod. But as soon as you look at something that doesn't say escape pod, escape look at something else. Look at the next pod. thing. All right, but don't touch anything else or look at anything. Well, look at other things, but don't. You understand. Holy Can fuck. Can you see it anywhere? I can't see it anywhere. I can't. Uh, tell you what, plug me in and I'll turn the lights on. Thank you. Let there be light. That's uh, God. It's quoting God. Oh, look at that. Turning. Ominous. But probably fine, as long as it doesn't start, you know, moving up. <laughs> no. Escape pod. Escape pod. No. This is moving up. Okay. Okay, no, don't, don't worry. Don't worry. I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. This should slow it down. No, it makes it go faster. <laughs> uh oh. Everything is initiated. on. Okay, don't panic. All right, stop panicking. Uh, I can, I can still stop this. Um, <gasps> Glado snow. Oh, there's, there's a past. Okay, it's fine. I'll just, I'll just hack. It's not a problem. Oh no. A a a a a. Um. Okay. A a a a a c. Wait, did I do beat the jump? Okay, start writing these down. Power up, complete. I don't. Okay, okay, okay. Listen. All right, new plan. Act natural. Act natural. Do nothing. Hello. Oh, it's you. You know her? It's been a long time. How have you been? I've been really busy being dead. You know, after you murdered me. Did what? Uh... Shit. Oh no! 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no! Ah. Okay, look, we both said a lot of things that you're going to regret. But I think we can put I our love her. behind us. For science, you monster. I will say, though, that since you went to all the trouble of waking me up, you must really, There's really the incinerator. love to test. I love it, too. There's just one small thing we need to take care of first. You monster.
There it goes. It's a long way to fall. Here we are. The incinerator room. Be careful not to trip over any parts of me that didn't get completely burned when you threw them down here. The dual portal device should be around here somewhere. Once you find it, we can start testing, just like old time. Oh, GLaDOS. No hard feelings, huh? Oh, great. Okay. Hey, Daisies. Hold on. There. Good. You have a dual portal device. There should be a way I back sure to do. the testing area up ahead. Once testing starts, I'm required by protocol to keep interaction with you to a minimum. Luckily, we haven't started testing yet. This will be our only chance to talk. Uh, I don't know if I want to. <laughs> Glados, we yeah. did not Let end on good point. terms. Do you know the biggest lesson I learned from what you did? I discovered I have a sort of black box quick save feature. In the event of a catastrophic failure, the last two minutes of my life are preserved for analysis. I Super. was able, well, forced really, to relive you killing me again and again, forever. You know, if you'd done that to somebody else, they might devote their existence to exacting revenge. Luckily, I'm a bigger person than that. I'm mm. happy to put this all behind us and get back to work. After all, we've got a lot to do, and only 16 <laughs> more years to do it. 16 oh, years? Nice. I don't have the actuarial tables in front of me. Oh, no. Oh, uh, great. I'll just move that out of the way for you. This place really is a wreck. Thank you, Claudius. But Gladys. the important thing is you're back. With me. And now I'm on to all your little tricks. So there's nothing to stop us from testing. For the rest of your life. <laughs> After that, who knows? I might take up a hobby. Reanimating the dead, maybe. I am not sorry, Lados, about what happened before. Oh gosh, it's been too long. Too Sorry long since I played this before. I really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh good, that's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test. <laughs> oh, which no. involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. It does? Right. Actually, I think it's more like here. There we go. Um. Now, how do I get up there? No. <laughs> right a bit closer. There we go. Alright, one moment guys, I'll be right back. Alright, now to figure out how to get to the place. Uh, I think I need to get myself up there before... Before I do the laser stuff. I don't think that's gonna get me there. No, we did! Oh, good. Let's do blue. Nope, <laughs> that was not blue. But sure. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. 
whole 16 years worth. <laughs> This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Discouragement redirection cube? Uh... One in a corner, huh? Okay. Oh, hey! You are still alive! Can I get up here? Now what? Oh, hi! Yeah, I, n I think I know what this is. There we go. Is my cube still alive? Is that really true? I'm being dumb. <laughs> I'm being dumb twice. Okay. Is there another cube that I could use? Oh, right. I can just use that one. Well done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even <laughs> testing for that. Oh, GLaDOS. You are... one of a type. Of a kind is the saying, but... Don't let that horrible person thing discourage you. It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better, science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. <laughs> Oh my god. Things are putting themselves together, that's awesome. I want to see that the GLaDOS part. Alright, let's see, what do we need to do? So... I can still take you out. There we go. Oh! Too many variables. Sucker's luck. Exile. Alright, let's see. GLaDOS isn't talking to me. But I can get this guy. Ah, uh -huh, so... That... Can go here, I think? Right? What did that do? That was just one button, okay. was button number two, right? No? Oh, shit. Okay. So, that... In blue. Congratulations. There we Not go. Not on the test. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. Let me see. Oh, what a bitch. Let me see. Don't even try. Vilif vilify? Feels like a trial. 
Lots of eyes. Alright, I should not have done that. Because... Yeah, now I messed up all of my testing stuff. There you go. <laughs> uh, over here? There. So... Now this one needs to be here, I believe. Yep. Should have done that first. One moment. Oh, there you are. I was starting to feel lonely. You are lonely. navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. <laughs> I, I, yes. Okay, I can't get in there. But this is the way for me to do it eventually. Lados? I don't trust you. Also, I want my... my little guy back. Who was saving me. Oh. I see. So we got a cube. Line up. Turn around. Shoot. Thank you. But it needs to go... that way. Can I do... blue there? No. Let's see. Okay, let's do a blue here, see what it does. Oh, I see, I see, I see. So I need to be here. And sit on that platform. shoot a blue. Get! <laughs> Jump too soon. Okay. Uh, maybe let's put a cube or let a cube stay there. Maybe I can... Well, not that. I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But Not really. Record, you don't have to go that slowly. <laughs> Thanks, Glados. So much faith in me. So much shit lying towards me. There we go, cube. If you credit, I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, Seriously? you don't have to go that slowly. Uh, that was a fluke. All right, blue. Give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. There we go. Waddle over to the elevator and we'll continue the testing. Oh.
This is something I can never forget. Her. <laughs> So would I need to fight her again by the end of this game? That would be a bit unfortunate. Because, I mean, she knows what I'm about at this point. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faithplate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. <laughs> Results were highly informative. They could not. Good luck. They could not. Okay. So what are we doing? I need to get over there. And there's a cube. Okay. I see. So what does it do? That's going to be fun. Nice. Here's an interesting fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. We just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. <laughs> so you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. I... Th I'm sure you did, honey. Let's see what the next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faceplates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. Of course by yourself. You killed everyone else while testing. Oh wow. Damn. Let's go for it, I guess. Oh, I see, I see, I see. I think I need to die. No, I don't have to die. Let's just put a blue here. There we go. There! And now do the same? Oh, sorry. With the cube? I'm still cleaning out the test chambers, so sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. Thank you. How about my little sphere? Cube! Is there a turret? Now, where is my button? Oh, interesting. Okay. There we go. 
Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. <laughs> of course, I mean, I am brain damaged, so it makes sense. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? Well, I wasn't I'm startled. Sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. I see. What is this? Oh. Okay. I don't know if I can jump over this. So let's not risk it. Oh, did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. <laughs> Go ahead and grab another one. Where is it? There it is. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. <laughs> oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. You would be. Oh, hi, hi. You are still there. You might still be alive. Okay, I see, I see. I don't think this is going to work. But maybe. Sorry, companion cube. Now let's try it. There. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. Wait this one a is second. Don't take anything with you. I want my cube. I can't have my cube. Damn it. Oh well. Could I have had it? I can totally have it. There we go. Ah, oh, shit. I think that one was about to say, I love you. And they are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. Well, I wish I could keep it. So where is my sphere? This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, um, shit. The turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. 
and the following people then I have to get to see Claire, <laughs> if you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. Lovely. Okay, let's see. Line up. And get hurt. So that worked. Okay. I see now. I think. So I can take the cube with me, I think. No, I cannot. All right, never mind. Or at least not in that way. So that should be enough. Yeah. Chapter 3. Wow. I must be flying through the game. <laughs> Easy now. Hello? What do we have? This goes that way. The aerial faith plate in here is sending a distress signal. You broke it, didn't you? There. Try it now. What happened, right? I was just lying there? You thought I was done? Hmm. This plate must not be calibrated to someone of your... generousness. I'll add a few zeros to the maximum weight. You look great, by the way. Very healthy. Try it now. Right? Couldn't believe it either. You seem to have defeated its load-bearing capacity. Well done. I'll just lower the ceiling. Yes? Ah, oh, shit. Go! Oh. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Um, let's see. Where can we go from here? Okay, so my sphere is alive. That's good. That's good to know, although he's now trapped. In here. That, I don't know if I can get to him. Curious. I can't launch myself that way. And this isn't going to get me anywhere. Hmm. All right, let's see. I'll need a cube. Yeah. This is going to take a bit, I think. 
so this one's not leading anywhere. Could I... I can't use that. No, I can use that. So let's launch ourselves here first. So we can grab the cube. Ah, shit. Wrong. Wrong thing. There. Button first, cube second. There we go. Oop. Right. There we go. Here's the cube. That is done. That is also done. Now what did I do? Oh, the button. I see. So... Okay. Yeah, I should be able to do this from up there. So let's do this guy. And that guy over there. Look at you, sailing through the air majestically, like an eagle. Like an eagle. Limp. There we go. Enjoy this next test. I'm going to go to the surface. It's a beautiful day out. Yesterday I saw a deer. If you solve this next test, maybe I'll let you ride an elevator all the way up to the break room. It's and already I'll tell the next you about day. The time I saw a deer again. Can I talk to my sphere guy? Because I know he's around. What are you doing with it? You. That's funny. Wow. Okay, so this one launches me this way? Oh, hi. Okay. But these aren't... Oh, so I need to maybe turn them off? Hmm. Curious? What is down here? That's where I came from. Okay. Let's try the highest guy here. Okay. Uh, let's do that. Okay, we're there. Oh, 
there's no buttons. What happened? Ah. I got it. So now... Let's see. Can I just launch myself over there? Or do I need to go all the way up there? Let's find out. Interesting. Can't reach it from there. So this cube needs to go down here. This guy needs to go down there with me. Okay, so orange would be that. Let's go grab you. Not quite what I expected, but that works. Well, you passed the test. I didn't see the deer today. I did see some humans. But with you here, I've got more test subjects than I'll ever need. So humans are alive, unless she's a liar, which she, of course, is. All right. Where is my friend? I want my friend. These bridges are made from natural light that I pump in from the surface. If you rubbed your cheek on one, it would be like standing outside with the sun shining on your face. It would also set your hair on fire, so don't actually <laughs> do it. Of course it would. I see. Oh, water. That's great. So I need to make it all the way there. Screw you. Oh! Only not with my eyes. Huh. Okay, so I can... I can walk on this. That's good. Let's see. Where did that disperse it to? Oh, to... to there. Okay. Okay.
So how can I get to you? Wow. This is interesting. So... Orange. And another orange. sure how to get oh wait no was easy <laughs> never mind I was like I don't know how to get out of this well here we are so let's do another orange there no here right yeah that should be it Okay. Let's do you. Get out of here. And just this way. Excellent. You're a predator, and these tests are your prey. Speaking of which, I was researching sharks for an upcoming test. Do you know who else murders people who are only trying to help them? Did you guess sharks? Because no. that's wrong. The correct answer is nobody. Nobody but you is that pointlessly cruel. <laughs> GLaDOS, I love you. Good news. I figured out what to do with all the money I save recycling your one room full of air. When you die, I'm going to laminate your skeleton and pose you in the lobby. That way future generations can learn from you how not to have your unfortunate bone structure. <laughs> well, my bone structure is working out for me very well, thank you very much. Perfect. The door's malfunctioning. I guess somebody's going to have to repair that too. No, don't get up. I'll be right back. Don't touch anything. No, no. Hey, no. Yes, here. yes, I where? I some bird eggs up here. Just dropped me to the door mechanism. Shut it right down. I, ah! Bird, 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 bird! What? 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 Oh, there. Okay. That's probably the bird in it that laid the eggs. There we go. Okay, look, the point is, we're going to break out of here. All right, very soon, I promise, I promise. I just have to figure out how to break us out of here. Here she comes! Keep te just keep testing! Remember, you never saw me! Never saw me! I can't believe he survived! I spoke with the door mainframe. Let's just say he won't be, well, living anymore. Anyway, back to testing. Okay, so what are we doing? Aha! Uh -huh. Right. See, can I do an orange there? No? No. Hmm, this isn't gonna end well. I don't think. Oh! What? I am not supposed to survive that. I think my portals are gonna die as soon as I... Yep. Okay, so that was not the way, clearly. Let's just say he won't be, well, living anymore. 
Anyway, back to testing. Right. So... Let's figure this out. Okay, so I can get on top of the walkway. Yep. So the orange can be this. And the blue. Let's see where the blue can go. So I need to pick up the cube. So blue can go here. Great. And now... Can the blue go there? No, not quite. I think the blue can go here. And I can pick this up again. There we go. Yeah, that's easy. In fact, you did so well. I'm going to note this on your file in the commendation section. Mm. Oh, there's lots of room here. Did well. Enough. <laughs> oh, I'm pretty sure Gladys is from the Midwest. Midwest US. Because the passive aggressiveness is so turrets. real. You remember them, right? They're the pale spherical things that are full of bullets. Oh, wait. That's you in five seconds. Good luck. <laughs> what do you got? There we go. I don't blame you. <laughs> of course I remember turrets. Why wouldn't I remember turrets? Okay. Sphere? Ball? You didn't see me now? Definitely still there. Hello. <gasps> oh, this is a better idea. There we go. That is much better. There. Now what do we have? Did I get one? I did not. Ah. Okay. Oh, I can drop a turret on a turret. How about that? 
shit. Did that quite work. Attempt number two. Turret on turret. Attack. There we go. Don't think that's quite gonna be there. Maybe? There we go. In one last one. Ah. <sighs> Needs to be a lot closer. Okay. They, oh, that is spot on. That could not have been better. Oh, wow. Uh, ball? Okay. Maybe I'll see you now. Maybe? To maintain a constant testing cycle, I simulate daylight at all hours and add adrenal vapor to your oxygen supply. So oh, you just may like be casinos. confused about the passage of time. The point is, yesterday was your birthday. I thought you'd want to know. Enrichment centers are so similar to casinos, apparently. What is this? What are we doing? Oh, curious. So that's going on. Can I do that? No? Ooh. So two of them are done, but that's not the right angle. If the orange goes here, here, no, there, no, that still doesn't work. Okay. Maybe now I can put it at an angle. You know how I'm going to live forever, but you're going to be dead in 60 years? Well, I've been working on a belated birthday present for you. Well, more of a belated birthday medical procedure. Well, technically, it's a medical experiment. What's important is it's a present. Of course it is. That jumpsuit you're wearing looks stupid. That's not me talking. It's right here in your file. On other people it looks fine. But right here a scientist has noted that on you it looks stupid. 
Well, <laughs> what does a neck-bearded old engineer know about fashion? He probably... Oh, wait. It's a she. Still, what does she know? Oh, wait. It says she has a medical degree. In fashion. <laughs> from France. Of course she does. Alright, what do I do with this? Okay, got it. I think. There you are. Nap time. Nap time? Hello. So, I see. Huh. Can I... Can I do orange? There we go. No, not quite. Doesn't work on the others. Okay. Got it. Well, I don't really need to work about, um, worry about those. Okay, so blue is my... Activated. Shush. Let's see, what can we do? Anything above? No, I think it needs to be here. Uh, how about this? This looks good. Uh, another orange? This way? Okay. I need to find a button. Or a cube to put on a button. And that's gonna be up there. I see. I think I got it. No, that was wrong. Right. Yep, that was very, very wrong. Okay, this, that, that. There you go. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. <laughs> Good. Now that. Still don't know. That's where it is. Oh, jeez. Who are you? Who do you think? There we go. I don't blame myself either. Good night. Good night. Good night.
<laughs> I'm going through the list of test subjects in cryogenic storage. I managed to find two with your last name. A man and a woman. So that's interesting. It's a small world. Has she blind my parents? That bitch. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Of Tell course you do. Would spoil the surprise. So I'll just give you a hint. It oh. involves meeting two people you haven't seen in a long time. Really? I see. So, what do we have here? Nothing. Oh, wow. Is anyone there? What would be the west best approach here? I see. I like this. This is good. Perfect. So? Um... I think... I think this should be here. And maybe I can... There we go. Perfect. This was really fun. Hello, Glados. What you up to? It says this next test was designed by one of Aperture's Nobel Prize winners. It doesn't say what the prize was for. <laughs> well, I know it wasn't for being immune to neurotoxin. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, more walkways, that's cool. I actually really like the walkway tests. I find them really cool. Aha! Uh -huh, I see. So let's go here. And I need to go to the other side. Hmm. This is a bit more difficult than I expected. Honestly. Okay, so that's where I came from, right here, and I need to go all the way there. So how do I... I think I need to have this cube on me. No. I think that needs to be blocked. Hmm. 
there. Okay. So that blue needs to stay. I need to get myself over here. Hmm. No. That's a puzzle. That's a good one. So the door opens. So how do I get up there? Wait, I need to get on there first. Oh, hello. What is this? I did not see that before. Tenacity. The bell invites here the turret, for it is me. Nell? Nell? Nelt. There we go. <laughs> that summons to heaven or to hell. Okay. Can I pick something else up? No. I mean, yes, but... You know. Okay, so... If this is here... Oh, I think I know what to do. No. Shit, I thought it was the right kind. Let's see, what do I do? So this is my walkway. That... That is where the orange is. Maybe I can run fast enough to grab it? No, it's it's the laser that I need to block. Huh. might still be the way to do it. This isn't the way. Unless... Okay, orange. 
zabić. Is this about on top? I think so. Okay. We might be able to fix this right now. I bet you think I there forgot about your surprise. I didn't. In fact, we're headed to your surprise right now. After all these years, I'm getting choked up just thinking about it. Hmm. Lots of turrets. Chapter 4. How many chapters are there? Can I... do I know? Return to game. Okay. Let's actually save. Options? No. Done. Okay. Let's see. Oh, wow. Well. Oh, Initiating surprise in three, two, one. I made it all up. Surprise. <laughs> oh, come on. If it makes you feel any better, they abandoned you at birth. So I very seriously doubt they'd even want to see you. Oh, thanks, GLaDOS. Oh, I, I need to- Oh, Jesus. Okay. Fun. What do I do? No. There's- oh, yep. This is how... This is how I get in the room, I guess. Okay! Sweet! I need to get rid of the turret, but I don't know how. Oh, great. Not at all what I wanted. I suppose I can't really use it, can I? Not in that sense. Hmm. Let's see. So I need to get there. And I need to find a button. Got it. This is getting a bit more difficult. Can I... just, uh... go here? Okay, so it's always going to be haunting me. This is the button. There we go. Okay. So... No? Let's try this. There we go. Ooh, 
<laughs> Sweet. Let's wait a bit. I need to go back there. Ah! Don't kill me. Don't kill me. I feel awful about that surprise. Tell you what, let's give your parents a call right now. <laughs> Thanks. The birth parents you are trying to reach do not love you. Please hang up. <laughs> oh, that's sad. But impressive. Maybe they worked at the phone company. Okay, so what do I do now? How do I get there? It's gotta be something to do with this. Right? There we go. Perfect. There's a lot of turrets, but I don't like it. Hey, how's it going? I talked my way Hi. onto the old nanobot work crew rebuilding this shaft. They are really small. So, oh. I know, Jerry. No, I'm on a break, mate. I'm on a break. Ow! Just hang in there for five more. What, Jerry? You can't fire me for that. Yes, Jerry. Or maybe your prejudiced worksite should have accommodated a nanobot of my size. Thanks for the hate crime, Jer. <laughs> See you in court, mate. Anyway, look, just hang in there for, for five more chambers. Five more chambers, okay. Well, you know the old formula. Comedy equals tragedy plus time. And you have been asleep for a while, so I guess it's actually pretty funny when you do the math. <laughs> yes, I think I'm going to end this here. Uh, it's been a lot of fun. I cannot wait to continue. Uh, this is going to be a very, very joyful ride for me. <laughs> Well, that was uh, episode 1 of Portal 2. Not confusing at all. I enjoyed myself so very much. <laughs> it was fun and very nostalgic to the times when I was playing Portal 1. I hope you guys enjoyed as well. And uh, like I said, this is, isn't going to be the main series. It's, this is just going to be kind of a tack on to what is already existing and ongoing so no one needs to worry about mass effect or prey or elden ring god forbid <laughs> being put on a pause because of portal but regardless i hope you guys like watching me try to solve all of these puzzles <laughs> and if you do please leave me a like and subscribe like i always say it really helps the channel I will see you in the next episode. Bye now.